Hey guys, it's Jessica. I'm here in my dining room today and I'm sharing some tips for styling a buffet or a sideboard. And so it's not that difficult if you can follow almost a formula for choosing your accessories. And step one is gonna be choosing a focal point. So you wanna choose a large piece of art or a mirror. You want it to be three-fourths the width of your uh, furniture below it. And you don't wanna hang it too high. I've got mine leaning here, but you could high, um, hang it and you want it to be like maybe five inches above the tabletop. So don't be you know, 12 inches above. It's gonna have this awkward gap. Um, you want the eye to see visually as one continuous piece. So um, that's the focal point. Then step two is adding in some height and you can go with a lamp or like I've done a tall vase with some tall florals here. This is from Target. Um, and then on the other side, I've added a little bit of height but I went asymmetrical with it and I just got some um, liquor bottles in here to bring in a little bit of height but if, if you're more of a symmetrical type, you could do two lamps on either side and that would make it easy. And then step three is filling in um, with layered accessories. And what I mean by layered is choosing things that are different shapes, different heights, and different textures. So you don't wanna put like two orbs on there that are different because they're both round, they're both, um, they're both orbs. So you wanna mix it up a little bit. So I've got this low bowl next to my tall vase, and while this is glass, this is ceramic. So it adds a little bit of variation here, and then I filled the bowl with some oranges for color, and because it sort of makes sense in the dining room, you wouldn't wanna put oranges in your living room because that's crazy. Um, and then over on this side, I've got my stemless wine glasses. Again, it's a different shape, um, a different texture, and my concrete planner with the greenery um, here. So a good tip for really styling any surface is to gather some of these smaller items into a tray because it makes it look organized and intentional. So I hope that these tips are helpful. Um, just to recap, you want a focal point, you want some height, and then you want to layer in with some additional accessories. And that is your, your formula for a well-styled buffet.